almost cried about five times today with this situation, but wait to hear how gorgeous humanity can be sometimes. On holiday, Everly lost her special interest toy, which is Mr. Monkey. This is her be all and end all. Um, she takes them everywhere. It is like the end of the world has happened. I joined every single Facebook group I could for the area in Spain that it was lost um, to no avail. So I had an idea to join a photoshopping group on a different social media platform because I see them all the time and they're really funny and I just put a post out there and explained the situation. I said, could anybody help me to create, I'll send like a put in a picture of Mr. Monkey. I was like, can you take pictures of him enjoying his holiday? Because we're going to tell her that he's been found, but he's out having this awesome holiday because we've managed to track down the manufacturer after going through eBay and Amazon and just everywhere online, we cannot find this Mr. Monkey anywhere. Found the man manufacturer and they just do it in bulk. But very, very kindly, they are going to hold a couple back for us to be able to buy um, before sending them to the zoos and stuff because you can only get them in like zoos and things. I think we bought them in Chester Zoo. Um, so they're going to hold a couple back for us so that we can purchase them, but it's not going to be until like the end of next month. So... This Facebook group delivered. When I tell you they delivered and my heart today has been bursting out my chest just with the kindness of people and how much it's going to mean to Everly. And when I tell you this little girl was up, every every night we've been home from holiday, she's woken up crying, screaming house down. Last night she got all the way through till five in the morning and then just boom, screaming and crying. Where's Mr. Monkey? Where's Mr. Monkey? Um, It's just, she's breaking her heart about this whole world turned upside down with this monkey and these strangers on the internet just from my request have gone and made all these pictures for her there's people made like postcards there's people who had a way to write a short story for her there's other mums who understand the situation because they've got neuro and um, diverse children and they're speaking about their situations and sharing and it's just wonderful and then there was this one woman and she's like, I saw your post in one of the Spanish Facebook groups because that's where I live. And she said, if he is found, I will go collect him for you wherever he is and I will post him to your house. And I'm just like, this is people who don't know me. They don't know our situation. And wait, I'm going to put some pictures in here of Mr. Monkey on his adventure. And all these people coming together and just creating this little story just for my little girl that's sad of our monkey <laughs> and it's just so lovely to see people who just genuinely do nice things because they care not because there's going to be any payoff for them or any reward it's literally just because they know a little girl has broken her heart over her teddy and it's just it's the sweetest thing in the whole world so I'm going to print out the pictures tomorrow <laughs> and post them through the letterbox so that she thinks they've been sent by Mr Monkey like the little postcard one and some photos of what he's doing and there's enough pictures that I can do this over the couple of weeks until we can get a replacement we've even got pictures of him having like this like spa date so we can justify the glow up that he's had you know like getting his hair done oh he looks a lot better he does it he looks new now well it's because look at this and it's like a picture of him like <laughs> living his best life so I'm so excited um that we'll be able to like every few days post more pictures through for her to think that Mr Monkey's been in communications with her and I just I know it's gonna help so much and it's just so wonderful I just feel so happy that there is amazing people out there who help people who are in my situation whose kids just don't understand like well you've lost your teddy and that's it it's just amazing and I'm touched and it's wonderful and I wanted to share that with everybody in the world because I just think it's so nice to know that people are still kind despite all the darkness in the world